Bruce Meeks is the former executive deputy attorney general for the state of Florida. He is very used to arguing cases, but last year he came across a problem he could not debate his way out of. And it had spiked to 6.1. Bruce was alarmed because of his PSA level, the determining factor for prostate cancer. It was extremely high and because he knows the facts. Fact is, African American men are more likely to get and die from prostate cancer than any other ethnic group. From 2003 to 2007, African American men had 234.6 cases per 100,000 men. That's compared to white men who had 150.4 cases per 100,000 men during that same time period. Doctors suggest at age 50 men get a PSA test and a digital rectal exam. But Dr. Philippa Cheatham, board certified urologist at Columbia Medical Center says for African American men and men with a history in their family, getting that exam earlier than 50 is important. So if you have a first degree relative with prostate cancer, if your father or your brother are diagnosed with prostate cancer, then immediately you're no longer average risk for the disease. Dr. Cheatham also says there are some specific things you can do to minimize your risks, like taking more vitamin D, drinking Pinot Noir, green tea, and taking immunotherapy supplements. Also, reduce red meat in your diet and increase foods with antioxidants. Things like the green leafy vegetables, the crucifer vegetables, the broccoli, the spinach, the kale, purple fruits, so berries, grapes, pomegranate. And that's what Bruce did when he got that alarming 6.1 PSA reading. Anything beyond a four, by the way, is considered extremely high risk. Within a week, he dropped that 6.1 to below four. Uh, and it's remained uh, stable.